Hey you guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I'm going to be doing another love reading for the Zodiac Sign of Aquarius. But before I get started, I want to tell you guys to go, I said started, <laughs> before I get started, I want to tell you guys to go subscribe and check out, tune in into the Star Card Tarot YouTube channel. Okay, she does tarot. She's a, a beautiful, accurate intuitive reader okay so please go check out her channel i put her channel name in my description box and also i share her videos and my community board okay so please go check it out you won't be disappointed at all so let's see what's going on so praise to my collective spirit guides and my light and sisters and masters my angel plan light if you want to get any promotions okay or tarot reading or tarot workshops just email me my email is in the description box down below okay Let's see what's going on for Aquarius. So we have here fake apology. So somebody here always apologize, but it be fake. Okay, we have outdated, but it's in reverse. So somebody here is realizing that somebody here is old news. They need to throw this person away. They're expired. Okay, somebody here is just fake as hell. And somebody here is tired of it. Okay, yeah, see, they're running away. Somebody here is done. They're seeing somebody for exactly who they is. Okay, this could be you, Aquarius. Okay, somebody here could have tried to come back with some flowers and thought that that was going to work. I feel like you either birthed them bitches or you threw them away or something. We have arguments. Yeah, arguments. Putting this person in place. So you put this person in their place and it's like you said what you said and you're done. You're not repeating yourself. It is what it is. Okay, somebody here could have two dogs. Somebody here could be a track runner. Okay, we have here family time. So this could be somebody that you either have um, a kid by, or this is somebody here that either tried to get you pregnant or something, but it never worked. Okay, somebody here, you could be arguing with this person because they're either their parent or somebody in their family was talking about you and they didn't take up for you or something. Or they're telling you what somebody said about you and their family. And it's like, why is this person so comfortable talking about you to me? You know, like supposed to be my spouse or somebody that I'm dealing with. And it's like, they talk shit about me to you. No, they're talking about me to you. Yeah, I'm seeing you're sick and tired of this person. Some of you guys are actually be sick. Or somebody here could be trying to act like they're sick to get some type of sympathy from you. Or somebody here could be acting like they're sick. So you can watch the kids or something so they can go out. Somebody here is not a good parent at all. Somebody here would rather be out roaming the streets instead of spending time with their kids. We have standing your ground ready for battle, defending yourself. Yeah, you're defending yourself with this person. Some of you guys probably, you know, just open up your throat chakra, okay? Like you're done being walked all over. You're done with this person trying to bully you. Somebody here is a bully. Okay, so some some um, body kid could be sick or something like that. This person either supposed to bring somebody to the doctor or bring somebody your kids some medicine or something, and they did it. We have Vin and talking about your issue. You could be talking about your issues to like a friend or something or somebody in your family. Okay, because it's just a lot right now. You need to talk to somebody. Okay, some guys either be talk to this person while you're getting your nails did or your feet did or running errands or something. Okay, we have here, trash, throwing away, getting rid of, tossing out. Yeah, you're getting rid of somebody. Somebody is telling you, agreeing with you, like, yeah, you're making the right decision. Whoever you're getting to. Okay. I don't know if this person could have warned your, 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 your stuff, your clothes or something. We have, it came out of reverse, though. So somebody here. Let me see. It say stress, busy, schedule. So I'm seeing here that somebody here could have took some time out from work or something or a busy schedule. Private relationship in reverse. And we have envy. Hmm. So I'm seeing here that somebody here was accusing you of like dealing with somebody or something, but you wasn't. Somebody here was just insecure as fuck. And it's like you're not spending no more of your time trying to like, you know reassure this person this person is very envious of you i'm getting like jealous jealousy hating vibes from this person okay this person could have always wanted to go through your phone like investigation and there wasn't nothing there that shit was annoying you okay 
Yeah, somebody here was money hungry as well. Will do anything. This person could have said that you money hungry. You a whore. Like you fuck for money or something like that. Or you're dealing with somebody else to have. This person thought that you was dealing with somebody else to have more money than them. Or, you know, just look better than them. Yeah, we have pregnancy test. I'm sure pregnancy scare, positive, negative. It's like this person kept trying to have a baby with you. But it's like this person even trying to have a baby with you because they want to get some type of benefits from that baby. Okay, like some help from the government or something. Or get more taxes or something. We have over a tide of drama. Yeah, I feel like you're over, you're tired of the drama. Okay. What else? We have here expecting to begin. So some guys could be pregnant. Okay. I don't know if you could either begin some type of abortion or something. Or this person could have a baby that you don't know nothing about. This person was accusing you of shit that they was doing. So this person could have had a power relationship. And it's like you didn't do. Some of you guys could have investigated. And you could have found out that this person does have another. A baby on the way or something like that. We have sexual protection. And you wish that you could have. You wish you would have had sexual protection with this person. Because apparently they did it wrong with this person. Whoever they did. You got a baby by. Or a baby on the way. Or this person can easily be sent at the condom broke or something like that. We have divorce, breaking contract. Yeah, you're getting away from this person. You could have been married to this person. For some of you this person is trying to like get a lot of money from you. Going through this divorce or some type of contract y'all had together. Or they're trying to fuck up your finances or something. That you sign with this person. We have coming in after you. This person is like possessed, possessive over you. They're obsessed with you. They don't want nobody else to have you. You know, like, ew, I don't like this energy at all. And there's somebody new coming in after you. Okay, as well. Oh, we have police. Yeah, you're going to have to get a restraining order on this person. This person is not trying to let you go. You're going to have to get the, the law involved. Somebody here is crazy. Yeah, see, watching shit go down and drain the gossip. You're going to be watching this person get jail time. Looking stupid and shit because they keep trying to bother you. Or you're going to have to get a lawyer or something. Pregnancy test. I keep seeing pregnancy, pregnancy. Who the fuck is pregnant? Okay. So this person could probably got you pregnant and probably got somebody else pregnant. And you like, you hope you're not pregnant. We have Diamond Girl Born to Shine. Hater. So it's somebody here that was hating on your relationship with this person and it's like they got this they want that they wanted this person to get them pregnant. This could be a freak friend of yours that was probably messing around with your dude or something like that or a woman. Okay. Behind your back for somebody. Or this could be a totally a totally um stranger. You don't even know this person. And we have fighting for what you love, claiming what you always love is battle Yeah, so this person is trying to like fight for you. They don't want you to go anywhere, but it's like they're obsessed in a bad way. I don't get this like a good way. This person's obsessed. Like, yeah, you need to, this person needs to check themselves, or you need to check yourself, go to the doctor or something. Okay, somebody here don't got all the, the checks ticked in their box. Like somebody here is not good mentally. Okay, somebody here don't got it all. Yeah, this person. This could be a boy, okay? You could change the genders, but it's like this person is keep trying to get your attention. They keep irritating you, keep checking you, keep texting you or something. It's like they were trying to have a baby with you. They kept trying to nut inside you because they were, there was their way of trapping you, keeping you stuck. We have getting played, manipulation, lies, control, and pulling the strings. So this person can either be saying that you manipulated them. In some type of way, or you can send this to this person, you're realizing what this person was doing to you, and somebody is in their fears because you don't want to be bothered with this person. Yeah, it's like this person keeps trying to get your attention, but you're ignoring this person. This person could be drinking or doing some type of drug here, and it's like when they, once they do too much of it, it's like they get in their feelings or something. Like they're in their fifi sex shop. Somebody here could either go to us be going to a sex shop to get some type of toy to please themselves so this could be you because it's like you either could be celibate or you don't want to have sex with this person or nobody right now okay we have caught up 
yeah, if somebody hit you with a sex shot, got some type of condoms or something, and you caught this the condoms or something, some type of evidence of this person cheating or getting caught cheating, we have recording in reverse. So this person is trying to make it seem like you're, you're delusion or something. Whatever you found, they're trying to put it on you like, yeah, they don't want to hear it. Like, that's yours. Like, you're trying to make it seem like I did something. Like, this person is crazy. And you already know what this person did. Clarify recording in reverse. Recording. Protecting yourself. So, yeah, you need to re protect yourself. Or you need to, re I don't know if you don't have enough evidence, but you need to record this person acting the ass or something or whatever they're trying to threaten you with. Okay, record that shit. Some of you guys need to get out your phone and record it. Okay, so you can have evidence. Protect yourself. You need to keep yourself safe. Yeah, or get some type of cameras in front of your house or something or move or something. Okay, just in case. If, yeah, because this person got anger management. Just in case you need to, you know, put a restraint should restrain the order out on this person because it's like this person doesn't know when to stop okay but i hope this video gave you guys like clarity if it did don't forget to like this video comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next video bye